of the prelims, Brazil versus China. Pucci is one year the elder two centimeters, the taller. No surprise that the grappling advantage is gonna go to Pucci. Very well-rounded, Che Chow, gifted in all areas. Ladies and gentlemen, this next match is three rounds of five minutes in a one championship featherweight contest. Introducing first, out of the blue corner, he is a Yogi World Champion, standing at 180 centimeters tall, holding a BJJ record of 170 wins and 55 losses. Training out of Evolve MMA, representing Brazil. Presenting to you, Bruno Pucci Pucci. And now, introducing his opponent out of the red corner, he is a freestyle martial artist, standing at 178 centimeters tall, holding a mixed martial arts record of nine wins and four losses. Training out of London MMA, MMA, representing China. Put your hands together for White Dragon, Xi Chao. And when the action begins, your referee in charge, Mr. Yuji Shimada. Oh. Oh, she's coming. For me, three rounds. More advantage, not going. Another pack, okay? Queen fight, queen fight. Final instructions from Yuji Shimada. We are set for three rounds of action at featherweight. Xie Chao of China, Judge. Bruno Pucci Judge. of Brazil. Ready? This one should be Ready? an absolute go. rip starter. Here we go. And Pucci bounds out of his corner. Pucci closed the distance immediately. Long reach on Pucci. Controlling center cage early here. Closes the gap. Precious Sia Chow back against the wire. You can see Pucci's getting nice and tight. Take down from the Pooch. Nicely done from him. Guard for Shea Chow. You can tell he's got his feet on the inside thighs here. This is where he's got to be careful. He's got wrist control on the right side. He's going to try to create a little bit of space with the feet on the hips. You can see how Bruno Pucci's trapped one leg already between his legs. So that's going to be a little bit hard. There you go. Shea Chow is able to slide out back up into the clinch. Bruno Pucci jumps into a guillotine. Can he find the choke finish here? Bruno Pucci in the very first round. Looks like Chow's gonna pop his head out. Looks like he got a little bit of space. Oh, but it might be across the neck. That's it. Oh, he's asleep. He's asleep. He's asleep. It's good night, Irene. Bruno Pucci is back. See, that is where Bruno Pucci is most dangerous when he punches into the clinch and takes matches down. That is what Bruno Pucci is all about. He wanted the choke. He wanted the finish. He called it out earlier. And he got it just like that, Michael Chiello. The Pucci ball. Bruno Pucci brings the house down here in Indonesia. And I'm sure world champion and wife Angela Lee watching in Hawaii at the moment. Jumping out of her seat for her hubby. What a stylish win for Bruno Pucci. Let's take a look at that again. Look at that. He just comes over the top with the left hand. Goes pan to hand as the geats. And you can see all that space here then. Readjusts his feet, gets nice and tight. If you're inside Bruno Pucci's guard, that is the worst place in the world to be because if you don't tap, you're gonna take a nap. That is a big win for Bruno Pucci. Let's go to Dominic Cloud and make it all official. Ladies and gentlemen, your referee, Mr. Yuji Shimada, has called a stop to this contest after 56 seconds in the first round. For your winner, by way of guillotine, Bruno Pucci! A very popular victory indeed. Back in the winner's circle is Bruno Pucci. That smile 